<clears throat> All right, let's get right to it. What? The front stabilizer? The Korean women's team in front of archery legends lost to China. Again to China. This is a complete disaster, not just because they lost, but because of the confidence this is giving China and the entire rest of the field. If Korea is going to win in Paris, they need to beat everyone. Sarah! <laughs> Sarah! <laughs> if you couldn't tell, I'm a really big Sarah Lopez fan, and it was really nice to see her at the top of the podium of the regular season again. But what really caught my attention was what she said in the interview after her match. She said she wasn't having fun over the last couple of years, but she was shooting because people, well, frankly, needed her to. But you know what? She's back. She looks like her old self, and she's having fun again. Let's go, Sarah Lopez. I just love, love, love this Sawyer Sullivan kid. Men's team win, mixed team win, and individual win, and he's just having the time of his life. You can feel everything that he's feeling because, quite frankly, it's written right across his face. And this is exactly the type of personality I love to see in our sport. Personally, I'm a Sawyer Sullivan fan. So after the second stage of the Hyundai Archery World Cup in Yecheon, we have new winners who have secured their tickets for the World Cup final later this year. I don't know if anybody's told Lim Shi Hyun though that she's already secured her spot because she keeps winning and winning and if I had to put my money on anybody, I think she might just win again. I cannot wait for Antalya.